I'm actually in the process of getting ready to edit this vlog and I forgot to tell you guys Happy New Year! Happy 2019 guys! Happy New Year! Okay, back to the vlog. It's your girl Rache. Welcome to the vlog. Okay guys, so we are in the Apple store. Okay, the Apple cult. <laughs> This is the first time I've been in an Apple store. The experience was very weird to say the least. Um, Rina! Oh, Rina's 14 months now, guys. Um, I have a bonnet on my head because it's raining outside. And, oops, mommy didn't button your pants. I, I went to go change her and I forgot to buy her pants. Bobby. And um, so yeah, we we're trying to see if we want to go to the Cheesecake Factory or PF Chase. Um, Cheesecake Factory, I'm not a fan of cheesecake. And they also offer pretty much burgers and stuff like that. So we just may go to PF Chase. This experience is going to be so amazing for me right now that I'm gonna be able to actually vlog and give the content that I want to give and have the actual means to um, edit my videos instead of just recording them on YouTube, record live, say what I have to say in one take and then just upload it. I don't have nothing to edit it with or anything. So I am recording from my iPad Mini 4. Um, I believe it's 1080p. Um, it has the retina. Don't get me started lying. But it has that and I feel like it's good. I mean, you can see everything on your girl face, okay? I have no makeup on. I am natural. There's no filter. There's nothing. Um, so yeah, so we're trying to figure out what to eat and then once we do that, then I will get back to you. Look how Sabrina acts. Why are you acting like that? Watching you. Watching you. Being all spitty and nasty, girl. A daddy trying to put you in the stroller. Alright, guys, so we are at PF Chains. We are gonna stay. Took off my bonnet so I can stop looking at Ratchet. And Devin. He said that he gave them his number and not the girl's one. Tag all the time. Give me my kiss. Mwah. Mwah. <laughs> so, um, so today, today, today the plan was pretty much to just get my iPad so that I can start vlogging. Um, Yesterday we actually did a seafood boy, which we should do today. But I actually wanted to get the iPad yesterday, but I couldn't. Um, time permitted, we couldn't. So we actually decided to get it today. But that crab boy was, it was good. That was the second time we did it, right? Yeah. That was the second time we did it. The first time it was really good. It was nice and spicy, but um, we're trying to get Sabrina to eat our food like everyday food instead of the baby purees and the milk and stuff she's 14 months so we're trying to get her to eat you know more food food so i didn't make it um really spicy yesterday so this is her christmas sweater has a unicorn on it um 
This is the first time I had her hair out in the afro in a very long time. She had some braids and some beads and two puffs in the front. And I feel like I gave her permanent parts. And um, you guys know my hair is usually natural. But um, for my birthday, I actually decided to get it straightened and I added some extensions. And that's what you see in my hair now. I have some extensions. This is not fully my hair, but my hair did grow a lot after I gave birth to Sabrina. My hair grew a lot because I actually did a second big chop in the beginning of the year in February before I found out I was pregnant in 2017 because my hair was long but it was half or I would say three fourths blonde and the hair wasn't growing anymore so it's like it would grow and then the blonde would clip off so you couldn't even tell it was any like real growth happening you just started seeing the blonde leave away and then it got to a point where my hair became like stagnant like it just stopped growing in, in the blonde it was just so dry the curl pattern wasn't there anymore so i just I, I just got so fed up with it i just chopped it all off and when i was pregnant with her like it just made everything grow really fast um so yeah when they call us to the table We ordered a lot of food. We're being greedy. <laughs> I ordered um, lettuce wrap, some um, ahi poke bowl. I always wanted to try that. I couldn't try it because I was pregnant. What kind of sushi we got? Uh, spicy. spicy tuna. A spicy tuna roll. And he got the new curry. I'm going to try his because I wanted to try it. But he getting it. What you ordered? Was my second trip. I just, I just randomly picked it. I said I want whatever spicy. I got some, Mong I think it's Mongolian beef. Spicy something. I don't know. But that's what I got. And she got nothing. She just had a bottle. But she'll eat whatever we are uh, eating. She hasn't taken a nap yet. Thank you. You're welcome to join. Thank you. And I got a coconut mojito. Mm -hmm. That's good. Coconut Malibu mojito. Coconut Malibu mojito. This girl has not taken a nap yet. That's that's the that's the real deal. That's the real scoop that's going on. And she was dozing while she was drinking her bottle. Sauce. 
god. Is that how you eat your snacks? Huh? You're so out of focus. <laughs> Raina's not even eating her snacks properly and she knows how to eat snacks. Wetting them all up. They're all over, look, they're all over your clothes, so eat them from there. Me. 
I wish you would win stuff. I I I'll put money on that. You would never do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Terry's Secret has a semi annual sale, so I try to take advantage and get some bras. Give me this shit. Yeah, look. Okay. This, this girl here she came in here. They were supposed to be having a sale on bras for like in Victoria's Secret for like $10. They were $10. They were supposed to be like $10. Well, the ones we saw the sale for. But they don't come, the, the sale don't go on the ones in her side. So she no. ended up getting, whatever, well, I don't care, whatever. Look, way. look, look, she done bought like 18 billion bras. <laughs> they like $50 each, nigga. What the fuck is this? Okay. Oh, sorry, sorry. You don't have to bleep this stuff out there. You don't have to bleep that out there, because... That's crazy. They done got. These bras better not snap, break, ruin nothing. Nothing. Oh, we going outside. Hold on. Yeah, I could have got that for you. <laughs> oh, we're dropping something. Yeah, I ain't. Nah, I gotta hold the bags though. Yeah, I gotta hold the bags. It's all right. You gotta do the fiance duties. You know, you gotta do the duties that I'm supposed to do. This is precious cargo. Look at this person. It's cold outside. Person this, this who went outside. Look, I got, I got a hoodie and this little jacket on. She could take this jacket, but she don't want it. I offered it. Okay, Dudi. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So we're supposed to be going to that right, way. So check it out. So at Victoria's Secret, they're supposed to validate the parking ticket. But then when when you spend over a certain amount, you get you only have to pay two dollars for parking. And when you spend another amount, you park for free. So get to register, pay for everything. It's well over the amount uh, so that you can park for free. And come to find out, um, they don't validate there. They're telling me I have to walk to a totally different store so that they can validate it over there, which to me is, it's stupid. It's really stupid. I don't get it. I don't understand it. It doesn't make any sense to me at all. What is up with this light? You're supposed to bend across. Yeah, it, it didn't say to cross. I don't know why. Touch nothing back there. Say hello. Anyone in there? Anyone in there? Pineapple. 
Fanta. All right, so here's the thing. Went to Victoria's Secret. I went to the semi-annual sale. I brought me some bras. Two of them, I actually think I'm gonna return because they were not a part of the semi-annual sale. Together, they were about $100. I don't think so. And back at the house, watching some TV. Baby's watching her shows. And can I help you? Devin on my business. Yeah, so that's it for today. Thank you for coming with me and just the start of my vlogs. And they're gonna see how this goes. Like everything should be how I want it to be. Now I feel so much comfortable doing what I really want to do. Um, today is Saturday, January 5th. Hopefully I can load it, upload it tonight. And Monday I go back to work and hopefully you can have a day in the life with me at work at the post office. So yeah. Until then, catch you next time.